Hello friends, welcome. Friend, Department of Telecommunication website has got a dashboard. Now in this dashboard, 5G BTS data is published on a regular basis at the end of the month. So latest data is 4,92,000 base station and it was published on 31st July 2025. Now there is another information which DOT keeps publishing which Telecom Towers. Now if you click here, Telecom Towers, it will take you through another dashboard and then you again click on Telecom Towers here, more, then it will give you two different charts. One, it will give you a Telecom Tower install. This is uh, a bar chart and you can plug in dates here and it will give you the latest data. So you see 13 August data was, has, been, has been given. So DOT keeps publishing this data and the BTS install also. The total number of BTS is 30,74,000 right, on 13 August 2025. Now friends, what I have done is I have aggregated these two sets of data. One, of the, one is the data about 5G BTS on a monthly basis and the tower and the BTS information because the total BTS information is what DOT is publishing. Now if I subtract from this total BTS, this 5G BTS, I will get the other BTS which 4G, 3G, 2G right, on an incremental basis. So this is the chart that I have uploaded in my website. So if you go here, you'll see tracking India's BTS and tower deployment trends. Now why I'm showing you this video today, because this gives some new exciting insight, which you will find different from what you have seen in the earlier months. So let me just show you what I mean. So if you look at here, you'll notice that. So let me just go to, I'll make it not 15, I'll make this 10. So you can see 10 months. So 10 months means October or may, may, let's make it 12, 12 months, okay? So in 12 months means 5G BTS on August 2024, it was 4.54 lakhs. Now it is 4.93 lakhs. Rest BTS means those uh, total BTS minus 5G BTS, the rest BTS, which includes 4G, um, uh, 3G and 2G. It was 24.72 lakhs and this, uh, the latest July month, it is 25.73 lakhs. So total BTS is 29.26 lakhs. Now it is 30.66 lakhs. Tower is 8 point, was 8.07 lakhs. Now it is 8.34 lakhs. Now why this is very interesting. The reason it is interesting is that if you look at the incremental numbers from August, because these are, because this is cumulative numbers. All that I've given you is cumulative in lakhs. Now, incremental number, if you see, August it was, for 5G BTS, was only 1,739. And then it was 3,385, 3,413, 2,262, 3,000 something, 1,000, 2,000. Then in March, it started ramping up. 4,442, 4,225, 3,299. 4,312. Now this month, which is July end, it was 6,450. Now, if you see here, what I think is going on, that these numbers were actually kind of was going slow. Because both Bharti as and Reliance Geo has clearly said that they have stopped, you know, investing more on infrastructure. Now, from here, you see that the base station numbers of 5G deployment has started ramping up. And this year, this month, it is on the month of July, you see it is 4, 6,450, 6, right? It is highest in this window. And now let me just show you what it was 10 months back or 12 months back. Now 12 months back, if I type here 12 months, so you'll see here that from 12 months, if I go here, you'll see that 6,000 number was on April 2024. Right, last April 2024, it was 6,000 number. And now in this, so let me just make it 15. That will give you a better picture. 15 means, can I see April? Yes, I can see, uh, no, I actually have to remove this 15 from here and make it 15. So it will become zero here and it will become here 15. So if I make it 15 here, then you will see I have what? I have, uh, no, I think this is not yet, over here, I'll put zero here now. And now you see 15. Now you see, month we have got 6,000, so I'll make it 16, so that I can, I want to capture this uh, April also. Yeah, now you see, 6,000, 
6,696 year on April 2024, July 2025, 6,450. For the first time in this window period of how many months? 16 months. We have reached that 6,000 level for 5G. So it clearly shows that Vodafone idea, probably Vodafone idea is ramping up their 5G investment. That's what my point was in this video because you know, if you see here, it's all tapering down from here. The incremental BTS is tapering down because both Bharti as well as uh, Reliance Geo, they have stopped, you know, their network investment. And from here, Vodafone idea looks like, because BSNL is not making that much 5G investment, Vodafone idea has ramped up their BTS deployment. And that is the reason why this has been ramping up. Now, there is another thing which is very interesting to observe here, REST BTS. REST BTS means it will be largely 4G because nobody is putting any 2G or 3G. Maybe they're a little bit 2G, but no 3G. For the first time, you know, in July 2025, this number is 21,000, almost like 22,000 base station in one single month in July. And if you look at all the earlier months, you will never find that this kind of ramp up has happened in the REST BTS. You know, 21,000, 22,000. BTS has been deployed in one month, which is which is why I'm doing this video to give you this insight. Now, if I go 15 months, 16 months in back, I can get you a totally new window. Let's see whether we had any period where we had that much uh, rest BTS, not a single. Maybe in March 2025, we had got 25.7K BTSs, but there have been hardly any month where we have got so much deployments. Let's go 30 months, 32 months back. Let's see what happens. No, the data is not there. Okay, so, so make it zero here. And then if I got a window period here, so you see 22K BTSs, so which is significant. We have So somebody is deploying 4G, maybe this is BSNL, <laughs> 4G base stations, <laughs> numbers which have been showing up here. So friend, this is what, which is why I'm doing this video to give you an insight that how, you know, Vodafone idea looks like that they have started deploying 5G base station and 4G base station numbers have suddenly ramped up in the network. Most likely this is BSNL, right? Maybe Vodafone idea a little bit, but this is BSNL. And the tower investments, if you see, tower numbers are also have increased significantly here. If you see here, this is 3,313 and rest all the months the tower numbers have not increased. So, Looks like Vodafone idea, though they haven't really have so much amount of funding available with the, uh, you know, from banks, etc. But still they are making a lot of investment in 5G, which is clearly evident from this ramp up. So if I take a four month window, so if I take a four month window, how many base stations they have deployed? Let's see. In four months, uh, 5G 18,286. You see, this is the, this is the window here. Right, and within this four month, the total 4G base station, it mostly it will be 4G base station, it will be around 45k, right? And the towers have been 9.7k. So that's all, friends. In this video, I don't want to carry this video forward, and just wanted to give you an update as to what is going on as far as the BTS deployment is concerned on 5G and 4G. And thanks for watching till the end, and I'll come back with a new video and a new topic next time. Thank you very much, friends.